Hello you guys and welcome to my channel. Thanks for stopping by. Today I'm going to be talking about the Physician's Formula uh, Rose Oil Lip Polish. So if you're interested, then keep on watching. If you want to know what I'm wearing on my eyes, it's actually Physician's Formula Gold Vault uh, Palette. And if you want to see a review and try on, uh, I'm going to link that video uh, at the end of this video. So back to the lip polish. So I wanted to try it. I, I'm i going to tell you straight up, I haven't tried a lot of lip polishes, but I have tried a lot of exfoliators in general. Um, and I wanted to get one because it looked attractive to me. And I do wear a lot of um, liquid lipsticks. And sometimes you need to exfoliate, um, you know, to make the surface of your lips smooth i have a million lip balms but for some reason i never bought a lip polish so it comes in the box like this it's really pretty and i think they are rebranding their packaging everything is becoming sort of like a pinky rose um, their logo on instagram recently changed so it comes in a jar like this which i thought would be glass it's about ten dollars and fifty cents i bought it for half price I think at Rite Aid and on their website it's sold out uh, on physiciansformula.com it's sold out currently and it's also on sale for $5.50 but the glass would be the jar would be glass like their rosé all day stuff it's all in the glass but this is plastic and it has this little um, spatula it's plastic as well so already for 10 bucks you could have given me a glass and a metal do you know what I mean? So on the box, you have instructions. It says gently massage lip polish onto your lips and wipe away with tissue to reveal the perfect looking pout. So I did this in the shower because I just didn't want sugar and ending up all over my clothes and my face. So I did it in the shower so I can wash it off and, and move on with my life. Once I open this, I got a protective screen, so that's good. So to me, <laughs> what attracted me, check out the rose petals, right? So you think it's going to smell like this guy, like their Rosé All Day collection. But to my disappointment, it smells nothing like the Rosé All Day collection, but on top of it, it smells like Play-Doh. It smells plasticky. So I'm a huge smell person and perfume person. I don't mind um, fragrance in my skincare and stuff like that, but as long as it's very subtle, this is not a pleasant, this is an absence of fragrance. I guess they just kept it as it is because this is organic wear um, line. Here we go. It's here. As far as the ingredients, they're saying that um, this contains organic rosehip oil, exfoliating organic raw sugar, conditioning organic shea butter, and organic coconut um, oil. When I look at the ingredient list, the first few ingredients are sucrose, which is uh, sugar, and then uh, rose fruit oil, and then coconut oil. So it's actually what it claims it to, to be um but the plasticky play doughy smell kind of turned me off and the other thing i noticed that it's literally sugar granules so imagine scrubbing sugar on your lips to me it should be much finer for your lips let me see if i turn down the lights if you could see it better See how big they are it's literally the sugar that you would put in your coffee to me i would want it to be a little bit more fine finely milled rather than that so it did exfoliate it did the job but the scent of it turns me off and the part of the sugar being so literally sugar that you would put in your coffee um for 10 bucks again i would expect something else 
I'm gonna try their other lip products, but I don't know if I'm keeping this. The scent turns me off. If you guys have a recommendation for a good lip scrub, I know Jeffree Star has really good ones, but I want it to be more refined. This could work like on your face, but even for my face, I think I wouldn't use it because that would be too rough. I don't know. Um, maybe I'm very being very picky, but I didn't enjoy this as much. So let me know what you guys think. Um, they don't have a lot of reviews of this on their website. And um, so yeah, sign down below. Have you tried it? Do you have a recommendation for a better one? And uh, like this video if you did. Subscribe to my channel not to miss my future videos and ring the bell. And I'll see you guys the next time. Thank you.